at this, look at what we're doing here tonight. It's like the United Nations. I feel like the Kofi Annan of pop. Mm, next up, <laughs> fresh from his pop idol triumph in Australia, good to see them actually win something. It's Guy! <laughs> Last month's spectacular Australian Idol finalist Sydney Opera House was the network's highest rated show ever. But for 21 year old guy Sebastian, the journey started six months earlier in Adelaide. There's a ribbon in the sky for Adler. Head and shoulders, the best voice we've heard today. What a beautiful gift. <laughs> oh. Thank you. <laughs> Apart from his voice, Guy's trademark was his afro hair, and soon there were lookalikes everywhere. You're absolute phenomenal talent. You really are. You're incredible. The winner, Guy Sebastian. <laughs> He's our most recently crowned idol, but will his winning streak continue tonight? Fresh from his triumph in Australian Idol, it's Guy! Yes, it is. I see trees of green. Skies of blue, clouds of white, bright blessed days, dark sacred nights. But I think to myself, yeah, what a wonderful world. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The colors of the rainbow, so pretty in the sky. For us, a the thing says, of people passing by. I see friends shaking hands, saying, how do you do? They're really saying, I love you. Why can't they just cry? I want you to grow. No, I'm not more than I'll ever know. But I think to myself, what a wonderful world. While I really hated that arrangement, and I'm not sure that it gave you as much room to show off exactly how good you really are, mm -hmm. between the crazy lid, the great smile, <laughs> you come off like you're from down under, like down under Memphis. I totally bought into that. Thank that you. Great. It's very kind. <laughs> I can't begin to tell you how proud I am to be with you, representing my adopted country in my homeland, you know, just showing off what I think is one of the best talents I've seen in a long time. Go the far. <laughs> Singing's about entertaining people, and you certainly entertain people. I think it's a great song, and I think you did it a good version. You. Will you win this competition? I think you're in with a strong chance, young man. Thank you. <laughs> the highest appraisal of the Polish judges was to invite a contestant for a Polish vodka. Uh, I would say the same to you. Here are two bottles for us. Great, Thank amazing, you. absolutely. 
Cheers. Thank you, man. <laughs> Oh, without question, the best voice we've heard so far. Um, you are unique. Uh, <laughs> if I'm being honest, um, if I hadn't seen the competition and then I read in the or saw in the newspapers the following day a picture of you which said World Idol, I'd be a bit puzzled. Sure. Because you do look odd. <laughs> <laughs> but maybe that's a good thing. But. Um, after the fiasco of your rugby attempt, <laughs> you did, you did pretty there, good. <laughs> pretty good, made up for it. Thank you. Well done. I went on there thinking, I don't really care what they say because I'm, I'm here to sing and, and I love singing and, and it's about, it's really about what the people at home are getting out of the performance. It's Christmas and, and I wanted to bring some joy. I don't think anyone can really rate their chances. We're, we're up against um, the world's best and, and people who are um, immensely talented and, and who have um, been loved by their own nation. Dude, did you hear that? The best voice so far. High praise indeed from American Idol's cranky judge, Simon Cowell. In fact, great comments all around. Go the throw! Yeah, it warms the cockles, doesn't it? It makes us very proud indeed.